I do like this, but I think Reyes, from what I from what I knew of him, he seemed like a much nicer man. Sloane did what she needed to do, but it went too far. Well, actually, we can Let's see where is it at. Roder. All right. Maybe we'll grab the beer real quick and then run back. Wow, that was a lot of, wow. I mean, it totally makes sense now. Everything, but, but still, wow. I'm just really, really freaking impressed. Ah, uh, well, no, that didn't work. Man, ugh, I hate it when we get stuck on stupid things. I oh, know. The jump button is basically useless. Give me that nomad. Oh yeah, there's actually a better way to do this going the other way. But, you know, it is what it is. Yay, now that's actually done. Drac. I got your granddaughter a surprise. Oh wait. Right. The water is safe now. Cause I cause I did good things. Yay! I'm glad the water's safe now. I can be under the water for a second. That's funny. I thought it would kill me, but my, when, when I duck like that, it keeps me alive. Oh, way back there. Fitting, Kadara's our second one. I suppose we'll do military here. Could be seen as aggressive, but this may piss off as many people as you manage to feed. Director Addison, no personal appearance. Placing an outpost is a big deal. Thank you, but no, I prefer climate control to these extremes. Honestly, an outpost on Kadara, where the worst of our exiles stake their claim. You better be sure about this. We can't turn our backs. The initiative failed them. You weren't there, but you're here now, and it's your call. It's a win, and we'll take wins wherever we can get them. You need to do this again. Another step forward, but of course there's more. There's always more. Thanks, and Mom. There's another matter, a ceremonial one, a statement for the archives. Is this really the time? Pathfinder was always a symbol. Like outpost flags hanging in the commons, the people need a connection to reality on the ground. Address them, Pathfinder. What did this mean? Getting this far was hard, and it won't get easier. But it will get better. We have to want it to get better. Kadara is the frontier, as wild and as promising as it gets. I know we're up for it. For posterity, Pathfinder. Addison out. Oh, I was like, where did I, where did I, ah, I got a shadow model. I have gained another cryopod point. Oh, hi. And Angaran, nice. So I didn't get to choose. Oh, look, you're just chilling out. I didn't get to choose what kind of outpost it was going to be. Oh. Where? Where'd 
Where's the terminal? Oh, no terminal? Okay. Um, well, wow. 97% viability? Holy crap, I did not realize that smacking an, an outpost down would help with that. Jeez. Jeez Louise. Well, Kadara is not the best one around. Uh, who's in charge of this place? Did I have any more that I failed? Yo. It's the science center. Wow, you're a cool looking Asari. Okay. <sighs> False alarm. Thought there might be some acid splash. I avoid acid splashes at all costs. Good call. It's terrible for the skin. Nessie Carter, science officer for Outpost to Taeon. You must be the Pathfinder. Were you also part of Mining Company 7? Yes. Well, no, I wasn't. What's a minor, mining but company I seven? Christmas and the others. They're my family. You came to Helios to be with them? I know it's silly since I'll outlive them, statistically speaking, anyway. But I just couldn't let them go on such an adventure without me. What are you working on? A hyperpotent phosphate fertilizer using Kadara's natural abundance of sulfuric acid. Hyperpotent? That's good, right? <laughs> Absolutely. My work will be essential in providing nutrients for gardens across Helios. When we have gardens, which we will, because of you. Cool. See you around, Kartar. Yep. Bye, Pathfinder. Kartar. Kartar. Hi. Something beeped at me. And I got some stuff. Yeah. Hey, yo. Nice to see you guys. Doing all your sciencey things. Where's the leader of this little band of misfits? Yo. Well, jeez. Hi, Gene. Thank you. Everybody's so nice. Their drill so is Christmas happens. in charge? Not a rock. Oh, she's here. <laughs> the Pathfinder. <laughs> Name's Riff. Mining engineer for Outpost to Christmas giving you a hard time? Always. But that's just his way. I don't mind. What do you think of Kadara? Mineral wise, she's a gold mine. Carter is already putting Kadara's resources to practical use. What about people wise? Oh, I'm not really a people person, but the collective seem all right. They certainly know the area. What exactly does That's a mining good. engineer do? Tell them where all the cool rocks oh, are. We're involved in every step of the mining process. Christmas is a good guy, a good miner, but he needs me to help decide where to drill and when to stop. Good chatting with you, Riff. Anytime, Pathfinder. I like you. You seem like a cool guy. Well, where's Christmas at? So this seems to be a mining outpost then. Uh, 
Christmas, buddy, where you at? Also, how'd you get that name? Seriously, where is he? The other guy was just sitting out in the front. I hear, I saw him, I saw his name. That guy just disappeared. There you are. Well, if it isn't the Pathfinder, welcome to Outpost Detail. Christmas date of Mining Company 7 at your service. Christmas. Is that a nickname? Afraid not. My old lady, Holiday Tate, had a sense of humor. It's certainly a conversation starter. Things going well? No one's been shot in the back, which is more than I expected. You have doubts about the collective? <laughs> I don't like making deals with people <laughs> flightier than ghosts. I'm an honest man who likes working with honest people. That's the kind of influence Kadara needs. Glad to hear you think so, Pathfinder. Anything else to report? Well, there's this cult. Huh? A cult? Seriously? They're harmless, but the thing they worship, that's what worries me. Some kind of massive machine. They call it Old Skinner. Could be nothing, but their leader, Bishop, went to pay tribute and hasn't come back. I'll check it out. Better safe than sorry. Appreciate it. <sighs> okay. Yeah, your name. You look like you've been around the block. That's one way of saying it. <laughs> yeah, that was rude. That wasn't. <laughs> hey, at 61, I've come to terms. I like with my older age. men. I'm the oldest of the outpost leaders, but I'm also the. I toughest. believe it. I didn't come to Andromeda to die. The opposite, actually. I believe it. You said you're with Mining Company 7? Best damn ESO miners on Mars, until the ground dried up. Putting your skills to use on Kadara? You made the water potable, but there's still plenty of sulfur in the bedrock. The director wants to use the stuff to make fertilizer. Carter can tell you more. Just, uh... Okay. <laughs> Detayon. Interesting name. Does it mean something? It's an inside joke among the company. Detayon is a temp name we pitched for our outpost block. It's actually an acronym. It stands for Deploy in the <laughs> I like ass it. End of Nowhere. Exiles giving you any trouble? We've actually taken a few on. He only the wants honest people. And collective variety. The uprising was ugly business. People just got upset. A lot of normal people got caught up in it. Yeah, like, and maybe some people when they got here chance. were like, hey, this is not all it's cracked up to be. Like, Sloan is even worse than Director Tan, you know? So. Thanks for the update, Christmas. Anytime. Why, why, I should have asked you about your name. I regret that. I was trying to be professional. Well, Coolio, look at this. What a nice spring, I mean, really, like... Okay, by the way, any graphical glitches you see are because my graphics are on medium and my graphics card actually technically can't handle it. So, I'm just glad it's doing as well as it's doing. So, it's not the game's fault, it's mine. Hi. Oh my gosh, these are from the trilogy you could never use these but they were always around i'm so glad wait what 
Dude, this is nice. People just chilling. This would be a sweet place to live. Kind of like combines a desert and a spring. I like it. This is way legit. So, I only got to choose what kind of outpost we had once. Look at this. There it is. I'm so proud. I'm so proud. These people are gonna do great. They're doing great. Did the nomad just magically appear? No. Actually, I want to go see if Riz says anything about the outpost. And then we'll head back to Tempest, allocate our points. So only a few people know he's the charlatan, like that sniper guy. It's kind of fun dating like the like leader, like, like wow, like really, like the Pathfinder is like sort of dating this like shadow leader of Kadara Port. That's pretty, pretty sweet. I mean, <laughs> I have a bad taste in men. I can't help it. I like a bad boy. It's not my fault. It's just, just the way I am. It's just the way I am. I got the thing set up. Oh, dang. Okay, I was hoping you'd say something about the outpost. Maybe later. Like, maybe, we'll see. Um, can we just go, nope, okay. That would be too easy. <laughs> it's okay, guy, everything's changed. <laughs> I'll stay here. I don't know if Reyes is gonna do something like that. Maybe I should go talk to the new leader, actually. That'd be cool. See how she's doing. See what she thinks about all this. Reyes is so smooth, by the way. So stupid. <laughs> He's totally Zevran and, and Hawk all mixed into one perfect man. Huh. I'm glad Dalton's still here. Seems like a funny dude. Bloodstain's still here, though. There seem to maybe be more Angara around. Oh, hey, Cora, what you doing? You too. Oh, that was nice of you. You're not on nomad guard duty? No need. Words got around. So your sweetheart's <laughs> ruling Kadara. <laughs> what does that make you? <laughs> Reyes needs to keep out of sight. A title would draw attention. Shame. He could at least get you a discount around here. Be careful, okay? He's still the same man who had Sloane Kelly killed. Wow, Cora! Oh my gosh! Saw a few places like this in my commando days. Trading posts and the terminus systems. Good places for fugitives to hide. Or try to. But not from Asari commandos, huh? Let's just say hiding with an arms merchant isn't as smart as you'd think. Especially when one of the commandos hunting you is that merchant's little sister. Nice. You okay? None of your business, Inard. Whoa, sorry. Just wanted to help. Your kind never just offers something. There's always a price. 
Living under Sloan, I can see why you'd think that. But we're not all the same. You do look different from the others. Cleaner. Yeah. So what's troubling you? My sister, Morga, works the pipes. Makes sure the port has filtered water. But she's been missing for three days. Shoot. Is Morga's line of work dangerous? It can be. Kadara's water is highly acidic. Fixing a leaky pipe could result in major burns. But no one knows Kadara's filtration system like Morga. Is it unlike your sister not to check in? Extremely. We're all that's left of our family. The rest were murdered when the Ket invaded Kadara. I'll keep an eye out for your sister. Thank you. Hmm. Look, they've got Angar and guards now. Mm -hmm. So is Kaida's gone? Oh, look at her smoking her cigar thing. Pathfinder. It's good to see you again. Nice chair. <laughs> You've done well for yourself. What's the human expression about having friends in high places? The charlatan and I agreed it would be mutually beneficial if I was the face of Kadara Port. Hmm. What will you do with Kaidas? The safest option is to execute him. But the charlatan thinks he's worth something. Oh? He was Sloane's confidant. The charlatan won't kill him until he's learned every dirty secret. Okay. The outcasts have disappeared from the port. Not completely. Kytus is still moaning in the holding cells. But the others have scattered. I'm told there's still plenty in the Badlands. Watch your back. Many blame you for Sloane's death. Yeah, well. I take it you know the charlatan's true identity. I'm one of the select few. I told him to tell you earlier, but he worried about what you'd think. It was adorable, really. <laughs> was it always the plan for you to take Sloane's place? It was a requirement for my cooperation, yes. As Sloane's Angaran representative, I had more access to the outcasts than the average Kadara citizen. Also, I could rally the Angara to the collective side. Nice. She's a clever lady. How's the mood in Kadara since Sloane's death? I doubt we'll ever achieve unanimous approval, but my people are happy to be under Angaran rule again. Sloane made a lot of enemies, even among your people. It's a welcome change. You're not worried people think you're a figurehead for the charlatan? My ass does more than just sit <laughs> in this chair. The charlatan listens to me more than Sloane ever did. He would. He would be wise to do so. I should be going. See you soon, Pathfinder. I'm, I'm glad for you. You look legit there, lady. Oh, I wish the best for you. He loved her. Now I feel bad. I could probably go talk to him, but... Uh, I probably, I will. I have to go. I have to go. I have to let him know what happened. <laughs> we'll see if he sees he in here. I don't know. <laughs> we'll go look around. No, not in there. Oh yeah, the holding cells are over here. Oh. Excuse me. Hi, Kadis. I've come to pay my dues. Sloane should have killed you the day we met. This isn't how I wanted things to go. I'm sorry. Damn your apologies. You were there. You could have saved her, but you didn't. Why? Sloane made it clear she would never forgive the Nexus. How soon do you think she'd have declared war on the initiative? Not soon enough, apparently. 
You better hope the charlatan kills me right up, because if I ever get out of here... Goodbye, Kytus. I'm sorry, Kytus. I am. I do feel bad, but... <sighs> Besides, the charlatan's my lover. If you try to kill me, you're gonna be dead in so many different ways. <laughs> That was cool what Cora was like, hey, you're the he's your sweetheart. I'm like, oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, let's see who's here. This is Cora, Drac, and jo Liam. And Vetra, okay. It's cool that they get, okay, another thing that I love is that they come out. She probably is, legit. Ooh. Opening up different avenues though for commerce. Ooh, jamming song. Drag, what do you think? What's on your mind? So Reyes was the charlatan. Wow, okay, we're just gonna he announce it. Everyone. Hard to trust a guy like that, but then I don't have to. <laughs> okay. Don't have too much fun. Drax got my back. It's early. Let's see if Umi says anything. What can I get Heather. you? Actually, I'm okay. Whatever. Uh, Liam. Be careful, right? Oh, shoot. Something on your mind, Liam? Just saying. Everything looks pretty much the same with the charlatan in charge. If he's being upfront about that, what you do is your business. What? What? That didn't actually make a whole lot of sense. So as long as he's being honest with me, you're cool with that? Is that what you guys are saying? <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> Uh, that is so funny. Yeah, I'm listening to these drunks. Aw, sweet. <laughs> she's like, I got frustrated and mixed in some tranquilizer. She's like, yep, that would do it. So have I like officially locked things in with Reyes then? Ooh, cool design. Ooh. Nah, says the collective pirate. I legit didn't think I'd be romancing a human. Petra, are you mad at me? So if Reyes is in charge, does that make you queen of Kadar? <laughs> I don't know. I'm probably more of a <laughs> consort or something. Consort? You deserve a better title. Demand to be a baroness at least. <laughs> I don't think that's a thing in Helios. You're poking my hey, boobs you're though. You're feeling me up. Baroness. Make up your own <laughs> She's feeling me up. But honestly, be careful. Reyes lied to you. Lying's not something you try once and quit. He didn't really lie, he just didn't tell me the truth, and there is a difference. I wish we'd found Kadara ten months ago. If people knew it was possible to build a life here, maybe the uprising wouldn't have happened. I don't think the, they would have built anything here if it wasn't for the fact that... people were exiled, and they were forced to come here. PB's upstairs. Yo, Vetra? Looks like uh, I basically have locked in my romance then. Interesting. I wonder, I mean, it'd be interesting to choose Reyes when you're not sort of romancing him. Why? It's so nice here. It really is kind of nice. Hey, Ryder. Since you made nice with the powers that be here, I'm fielding a lot less animosity from the average outlaw. <laughs> How much animosity are you dishing out? Oh, no me. 
If I don't get into scrapes here and there, I get angry. <laughs> Gotta keep yourself occupied. Look at this. He's got all this. Eee! I think he'll run it a lot better. I don't think he'll let the power get to his head. I think he'll keep his feet firmly on the ground, you know? Interesting. Wow. That's just... Oh, let's check, um... Let's check our codex entry. Let's see. Uh... Journey so far. Trader and Kadar port. We don't have that. Crew like no other. Romantic entanglements. You found opportunities for romance outside the Tempest and you drive as Pathfinder. After a disastrous first date, you're in an exclusive relationship with the notorious charlatan and secret leader of Kadarbor Raisin Hag. <laughs> they make it sound so cool. Oh. Uh, you helped Raise Vidal, aka the charlatan, eliminate Sloan Kelly and Kadarbor. He now runs things on the planet through his Angaran proxies. Okay. Mm. Okay. All right then. Nice. <laughs> Yee. I I do think things are going to be better. Oh man. Yeah, the charlatan would. Yeah, but, you know, I'm just listening to you tell people off. Yo, Vetra. Well, that was fun. Jeez. I wonder how that's going to work. I'm really interested in the idea of having a planet side romance. It's gonna be different. I, I, it's gonna be different. Boop, 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 boop. I gotta let people out of cryo. Yo, I will talk to you all in a minute. Uh, uh, I need to go to bed. I know. Okay, uh, collect reward. Oh, thank you. Okay, let's, uh, did we? I think we chose commerce last time. Hmm. Oh. Why Eos? Alright, well, let's get one of these and we can get advanced training. Consumable supplies, organic material, tech material. Let's do hidden caches. Yeah. And yeah. Oh crap. Uh, let's do a science pod. Ooh. Oh, shoot. That requires... Okay. These ones have... Interesting... Oh, so this is like your science -y planet, and then EOS is more like a military, I guess? I don't know. Oh. Let's do that one. Okay. Doing some pod stuff. Doing some pod stuff. Where's my email? 
Let's see if we can talk to Sam about this. It was kind of cheating that he that he did that to Sloan. I we got it. I don't know if this is gonna bite me in the butt later or what. Did we get any new ones? Ooh, Kadara. Space Outlaw. Hello, Ryder. Pathfinder. May yes! you discuss your romantic attachment? Yes! Alright, but I hope you already know where babies come from. My experience of such attachments was a long-established relationship. Cherished, familiar, but tragic. Mom and Dad. I have never known the beginning of an attachment. Perspective on your partner would place it in context. Hmm. I really care about him, and I hope he feels the same. All life strives for connection. Now I understand better. Thank you. Oh, interesting. Okay. Cause I did. I almost thought about doing the support one, but I think she just, she just, for whatever reason, she just likes him. You know, she just. There was something about him, charming, roguish dude, and I don't think she's like falling at his feet or anything. You know, like love me, but, you know. He does want that connection with somebody and he seems to want a connection back like he legitimately seems to want he seemed to want her to know who he was because the charlatan is just you know one side of him whereas she knows maybe a more true side of him i don't know thanks sam nothing more <laughs> <laughs> it's for me. It's for hard to focus all these flashbacks to a certain cave. I blame you. <laughs> for me, everything in place protection wise for your new outpost and port trade is up and morale is good. Our partnership is working out on all fronts. Not that I had any doubt. You keep playing the hero and I'll keep mate and I'll make sure Kadara stays ours. Thinking of you always. <laughs> From the Bootleggers Association of Kadara. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, shut up. Shut up, Breeze. You're making it hard. Don't you make it hard on me? Pi Jack, how's it going, Pi Jack? You in here? Nope. Okay. Is it? No. Okay. Thought I saw like a, a ship under my bed. Maybe we should play with the jacket. Oh, uh, oh, it got the it, it has the customized. Oh, I like it. It's got the customized color. I like it. So they all have it. Okay, so you can't go back. It's all got the same look. Okay, interesting. I like it. Okay, look at the gloves we get with this one. She looks good. She looks sassy. Yeah, look at this. We're 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 the queen of Kadara Port. We're gonna look like it. <laughs> anyway, it's super late. I should go to bed before I die. But that was fun. That was uh, that was nice. I can't wait to show you guys all this. You guys are really far behind currently. <laughs> Uh, it uploads and I just today I messed up and uploaded one twice or something I don't know what I did something stupid but anyway thank you guys for joining me I very much appreciate it I hope you've enjoyed thus far and that certainly took a turn for the strange and not what I expected so that was cool thanks Andromeda <laughs> anyway thank you guys again and I'll see you in the next one